All right, so as I start this video in week two of the quantum trading build, I showed previously how or what is quantum computing and in trading. And specifically going to speak about how my system, my edge, my portal, my trading desk, uh, which I'll go more in detail later in this video, uh, and how it's changing the game in trading per se. And that is it, folks. I'm not going to go into using quantum computing and how it will adapt in real world technology because well, number one is not something that I am called to do. And number two, I'm not going to waste my time. And so this and this week, too, of the quantum trading build uh, or the system has just evolved. And we began as a raw execution, and now it behaves like a multi-asset human-style trading desk. It reacts, it logs, and adapts. And it's scaling fast. And everything that I built this week is, well, I'll show you something. I'll show you everything I built this week. And why it's changing more than, more ways than one. Multi-dimensional ways, actually, at that. And last week, we launched something called the Real-Time live trade execution uh, which is we also connected to kraken and we got a cli trading live foundational love it phenomenal love it and i was excited but it was limited and everyone who does know me uh knows how i think and where the truth lies within limitations but this week what got me more excited it just got smarter and from multi-asset support, from trade objects with full metadata, real-time P&L tracking, and human-style signal logic with scalable logging, just like any trading desk. And right now, uh, the system does trade from Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Solano in parallel. And I just want to add, might add more assets down the road uh we shall see but for now i'm gonna keep bitcoin ethereum and solano and it's not because i support bitcoin uh bitcoin bitcoin ethereum or solano or i think that they are the trinity per se in cryptocurrency it's one it's more of there were my first crypto assets that i invested into way back when i was a young buck uh so that's the main reason why each asset i pick those these asset and those and not only does do bitcoin ethereum and solana have its own trading strategy pipeline it also has its own paper balance equity tracking and trading block and assimilates uh basically each position has ten thousand dollars uh per asset so it equates to about thirty thousand in portfolio in total and it's starting to feel like a true trading desk and yeah trading desk let's let's go with that and with a unified portfolio tracking in with individual trading autonomy phenomenal right and it simply was supposed to be a bot way back then about two, i don't know how long ago it was uh but then i gradually evolved and now started adding onto it and that's the thing about real world technology because that's not quantum computing and that's not the blueprint uh, for me it was more to make sure that i tap into full potential because i love my potential it's, it, yes it can be scary when you don't tap into it but for me i'm excited where my potential is leading to and since uh, this trading desk portal system is an extension of myself why am i living something like quantum technology when it's not supposed to be limited and that's the one thing that I've noticed when I used to use Crypto, phenomenal automated uh, trading platform for trading multiple, uh, hundreds, thousands of cryptocurrencies, uh, multiple integrations with exchanges and hats off to them because they made my life and many of my other friends' lives a lot easier. And when it came to crypto trading, we didn't have to sit on the computer 24 seven and back then, Oh yeah, there were times where we or sleepless nights where our our best friend, our girlfriend at the time, and but it was a learning experience for us, right? Um, and it was fun at the moment, but at the end of the day, I noticed there were some or are potential holes. But that's 
nothing wrong with AI. It's not dumb. Because that was automated training. It was great. But it was not reliable for me. And just as a person, if you know who I am, you know why. And so that being said, before all that happened, before all the upgrades happened, the system just knew long or flat. Boring. Snore. Mitch, let's get this going. How can make this more exciting for myself? And so now it logs entry and exit time, size and price, and realizes P and L. And that opens the door for trade journaling, uh, risk elevation and risk and yeah, risk elevation, so on and so forth. But that's that's the thing. Um, right now, I mean, I'm doing this raw. Sleep is important, folks. But at the end of the day, um, or actually, it is phenomenal. But in my case, in my case, I'm glad I didn't sleep because I had a lot of elevations, elevations last night. So just bear with me for a moment. I'm going in raw right now, and this is not just a code that trades. It's a structure like a trader that logs every boo. Signals don't just fire anymore. They don't have duplicates anymore. They wait and they wait for the best opportune time to fire. And the system now thinks logically, adapts logically, decision making, waits for confirmation. It also enters only with clean logic and tracks and assesses just like how a real trader should. It's not just putting out data. It's not just trading and buying, selling, stop loss and doing everything it's do. It's, it's, it's doing, it's acting as a, an elite trader, disciplined trader. And the best part is this system is not automation. It's augmentation, motions that hinder us. And logic that can hinder us when it comes to trading. I don't need to go into how emotions can be a liability. I also don't need to go and explain how emotions can be in a way beneficial for us. But in this case, for crypto trading and what this is being built for, it's a way to, it's now realizing, now updating trades with realized and unrealized P&L per asset equity as well as timestamps. So, Mitch, what are you jabbing about? What are you, you know, talking about? And what I'm talking about is, this is not just logical. Yes, we're using this in paper mode right now, but it's full live mode ready. And you're asking, okay, why does this matter to me? Or maybe asking both of other questions. Probably a bunch of questions out there under through your mind right now. And wondering, is this real? Is this actually going to happen? Is this, what is this new tech? Because no one out there is building this. No one out there has even thought about it. Um, and that's the thing. I want you guys to feel free to DM me and comment on, comment with questions. Um, especially no matter where it is, you know, if it's on my website or if it's on my Instagram, ask your questions. Cause when new technology out there, things get a little bit fun or crazy, right? Um, for me, I don't. Personally, I think I ask dumb questions, but for you, regarding this type of tech, there's no such thing as a dumb question. And with that being said, it's not just about automation. It's all about argumentation. And I like that. We're building a system that thinks and manages capital like a disciplined trader. No emotion, no guesswork, just logic, rhythm, and clarity. And I love clarity most likely my second wife and so like i said it's not augmentation not i it's not automation it's augmentation it's coming up and what's coming up in week three probably going to do some strategy switching in real time equity dashboards uh session tracking and quantum reinforce integration maybe maybe it's a little bit more maybe a little bit less depending on how my brain is firing next week probably change it up a little bit uh we shall see but i will continue posting updates on my on x at, i think it's rob crypto tech uh, my instagram story as well rob also on this community page uh so yeah this this system is one that will mirror 
elite trading desks and also surpass elite trading uh, desks. So if you're following this build, thank you so much for following. Uh, thank you for liking my posts as well. Thank you for voting, uh, giving me what you think. Uh, thank you for your trust and the possibility of trusting this quantum uh, signal per se over other tools. I think that is awesome of you guys uh, that your guys are becoming more open minded. I think that is phenomenal. Uh, not just a for this per se, but it's great to be knowing that there's so many people out there who are open minded to something that's brand new. And I don't expect anyone or everyone to hop on board, even those, especially those who are not ready. It is what it is, right? But I do expect uh, for you guys to feel free to ans ask me questions, to rebut me, to understand what this technology is all about because what i would like to think is when it comes to the real world technology and i've been using this harrison the door of my service calls is it's useless putting a ferrari engine in a toyota corolla yeah this edge is not about speed i'm not building this edge because i want speed that's not smart it's not logical and it's not smart nor there's no intelligent in speed and it's all about intelligent for me, especially for my edge for this platform, this for this augmentation edge. I want it to be intelligent. This that's all I want at the end of the day. Because if we build this with speed, if I if I build this with speed, it's not going to do what it needs to do, and that is not divine, right? And that is most importantly not who I am. Tim is here. And if you're still interested, maybe you're due. Maybe no longer curious. Maybe that curiosity is evolving. Maybe it's time to read that playbook. The Quantum Edge playbook is linked in the description below. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me on my YouTube channel, on my Instagram page, X, or even uh, submit a contact form on www.treyboshub.com. I'm here to ask, I'm here to ask, I mean, answer all the questions that you may have for me to do the best of my ability to help you understand and get some clarity. And thank you so much for watching this video so far. And again, I will be posting more updates the following weeks and weeks after that to build up to real live training. So have a great one and talk to you soon.